This is the climate control panel for adjusting airflow, fan speed, and temperature inside the cabin. It is made up of an airflow control dial, temperature control dial, fan speed control dial, air intake lever, and two buttons. The fan speed control dial regulates fan speed at various settings. Turn it to the left for slower speed, to the right for higher speed. Turn it all the way to the left to turn the system off. Press the AC button to the lower right of the fan speed switch to turn the air conditioner on or off. This is the temperature control dial on the right. Turn it to the left for cooler or to the right for warmer air. For quick cooling when the temperature is high, slide the air intake lever all the way to the right. The airflow control dial provides a choice of airflow outlets. Turn the dial to select the desired outlet. Refer to the icons for the various airflow combinations. Air will flow from center and side vents. Air will flow from center, side, and foot outlets. Air will flow mainly from foot outlets. Air will flow from the defroster and foot outlets. And air will flow mainly from the defroster vents. In hot or humid conditions, a visible mist may be seen coming from the vents. This does not indicate a malfunction. The lever in the middle above the fan speed switch is the air intake lever. Slide it to the right to recirculate air inside your vehicle. This helps AC efficiency and helps block outside odors from entering the cabin. Slide it to the left to circulate outside air throughout the cabin. To defrost or defog the front and side windows, turn the airflow control dial to the defroster position all the way to the right. The AC comes on automatically and cannot be turned off. This helps dehumidify the cabin and clear the windshield faster. Now, turn the temperature control dial to a setting that will best meet weather conditions. For windshield de-icing, your temperature selector should be turned to maximum heat. Also, turn the fan control dial all the way to the right for maximum fan speed. If your vehicle is equipped with a rear window defroster switch, push it to defrost or defog the rear window and if so equipped, the outside mirrors. The indicator light will illuminate. After defrosting, push to turn off. Otherwise, this feature will turn itself off in a period of time. Please see your owner's manual for important safety information, system limitations, and additional operating information.